What's happening, guys? Sorry, I had to go and get my shit off the Snap-On's truck and get my warranty stuff. So we are rocking live here in the shop. End of a long ass work day. I don't know about you guys, but this has been like one of the longest work weeks in like ever. I Let's see, how many hours am I rocking right now? Huh. Let's look at this one. Let's look at this. Let's turn this around. So we're at 54.3 hours for the week. It's Thursday. Yep, 54.3 hours for the week. Plus on this stupid Grand Cherokee right here, I've got like 13 hours tied up into that thing. So it's been busy, 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 busy. All kinds of busyness. So what you guys are actually here for, which let me find it because I've been using it today, is this sweet sexy looking sp tools mini impact gun that i have teamed up with sp tools to be able to give away to you guys my awesome fan base so we ran this thing for two weeks and now we're going to do the giveaway on it and if you guys don't win this giveaway trust me there's a whole lot of yeah there's some gray in here whatever um, there's going to be more chances for more giveaways coming up here soon. Um, if you guys liked this impact and you don't end up winning this one, uh, there's also the chance for you to, or the choice for you to go and purchase one of your own over at www.sptools-usa.com. Also, you're going to put in the code RB impact, and that's going to get you that tool plus the five piece stubby impact socket set for 250 bucks normally it's 299 which is already a decent price i thought at least you know for that amount so for that one you'll be able to get it for 250 bones if you don't end up winning this one so looks like we're about two minutes in so i think that we can go ahead and run this winner contest here so we're gonna flip you dudes around don't pay attention to all my mess and all my scan tools i've been using jrc 54 go check him out there's the captain. Hey, I found a gray screwdriver. Yeah, screw you. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go over here, and we've got a random comet generator here pulled up, Wait, and this I is this real quick? no. What do you mean no? I said no. <laughs> this is Bullshit. the the link here for you. So shots. we are gonna do the random winner. You guys ready for this? I know. New video is premiering here soon. All right, here we go. Come on, Captain Ron, get up, give us a drum roll. Winner is Jose Martinez, hey, who said, name. enter me. Jose Martinez is the winner of the competition. I identify as Jose. I bet you do identify as Jose. <laughs> so if you are Jose Martinez, I need you to email me over at the Rust Belt Mechanic at gmail.com. And I will, and I also you need to include your Instagram tag on there also. So I can go over and check your Instagram followings on that one. And then you are gonna be getting the SP Tools Mini Impact I will get with you on how you are gonna get that one. You're actually not gonna get this one because I've used the shit out of that one. You don't wanna use tool. You're gonna get a brand new one from SP. They're gonna send it to you uh, here in the next week or so. So make sure you get a hold of me on that one. Plus, stay tuned here, guys. Here within the next half an hour, we're gonna do a premiere on the next video that I'm launching, which kind of, you know, irked my Snap-on guy a little bit, kind of irked my Matco guy a little bit because I got some Matco tool grid stuff for the Snap-on Epic box. It turned out really good. So for you 36 guys who are in here and you wanna see what we kind of did here, give you a little sneak peek at the tool grid. Da, 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 Matco tool grid in a snap-on box. That's what it is. So yeah, that's what that video is going to be about and how much time I actually spent on freaking putting that thing in. We're just going to say it was miserable. I think I spent like three and a half hours 
on putting that stupid thing in. I, it's more it's more time than I spend on a lot of vehicles here in the shop. So it was daunting to say the least, but I think it was well worth it. That's why I got so many hours this week. <laughs> no, that definitely say, does bitch, not. You got paid to do that. Does not, you know, contemplate going into that one at all. So yeah. So make sure Jose Martinez, you get a hold of me over at therustbeltmechanic at gmail.com. Uh, if said Jose Martinez does not claim his prize, we'll say within, well, by this weekend, three days, end of this weekend, if that uh, prize is not claimed, then I will do another drawing on Monday. Hopefully they do. If they do, I will be sure to post it and photos of that on Instagram for everybody to be able to see. I appreciate everybody getting in on this competition. Uh, there was almost 370 entries on this one. The video did pretty good. It's exactly 370. 370 entries. Yeah, we had like four or five get put in within the last like hour. So that was really cool to see so much input into a giveaway like this. I'm going to be doing a lot more in the way of some giveaways coming up here soon. Uh, if you go over and you look at my subscriber count, you're going to notice it's at like 19,700 ish. We're only like 300 away from getting to 20,000. And when we get to 20,000, we're going to do a really big giveaway. It's okay. going to, it's going to put this one. It's still going to be a tool you're still going to be able to use it in the shop, but it's going to put the $250 SP mini impact to shame. It's going to be way bigger than that one. Are you getting your 20K Hellcat? Yeah, screw you and your 20K Hellcat. Are you going to get me that 20K Hellcat? <laughs> I don't have money to pay for my Duramax. No, it is not going to be an SP toolbox. But just to keep in mind, I am going to be doing a lot more work with some SP tools as well. I picked up a lot more of them for at home and here at the shop. So I'm going to be kind of introducing those into the channel because I've, I've really been working with a lot of SP tools here lately because I don't really like to do a whole lot of really in-depth tool reviews until I get my hands on and being able to use them really well. One of those will give you a little in-depth you know look and sure. having a look at this I'll, one i'll get you a little further away because you're going to need it whatever you're going to need it on this big mamma jamma this thing is a four a little over four foot long probably a 60 pound pry bar from sp tools for getting control arms off of 50 foot or uh 3500 stuff on the pro masters when we pull transmissions you need a hefty pry and stick in that one turned out really, really cool. So we got lots more coming up. I think it's beefy. Uh, yeah, it's beefy to say the least. So we got lots more coming up in the way from SP Tools and a couple of other giveaways. Uh, if you guys haven't checked out already, go over to Tool Heads Crate for the Golden Wrench winner this next month. We are giving away, actually, we can show that one too because I have it here. I've been using it. Let's have a look -see. Here, if I'm videoing, I'm putting it on the good camera. I'm working at it. Where's the buttons? Stupid iPhones. This is the set that you are going to get in the way of the Tool Heads Crate Golden Wrench winner. 20 through 32 millimeter, 15 degree offset ratcheting wrench. These things are freaking awesome killer. I, I've never seen a ratcheting wrench go this large before, let alone be this easy and very nice sounding. How these things ratchet are really cool. You can see the adjusters here on it are really nice and they sit really well flat seated to the surface. So they don't stick out a lot and get caught. I always hate when you have to, you know, readjust these after they get caught on whatever you're trying to work on and they switch directions on them. It's a pain, big pain in the So this kit valued at almost 400 bucks is gonna be the Golden Wrench winner. So make sure you go over and check out Toolheads Crate at www.toolheadscratewithaz.com and check that one out. You guys have until the 9th at midnight, technically the 9th into the 10th, uh, to be able to hook up for this next month's crate. They ship out on the 15th. So you have one day, one more day. So by tomorrow <laughs> at midnight, that's how long you have to hook up for this next month's break. This weekend, myself, Captain Rome, and Truckmaster are going up to HSP Diesel 
and we're going to be looking at their brand new facility. They just opened up here in the last couple of months. So we got some really killer Duramax content coming. Uh, we're going to be doing some work with them and we're going to be seeing their processes with, with ordering, how things are made, as well as their company as a whole. We're going to be looking into that kind of stuff and then we're going to be going over to uh, Matt and Josh's place, which is about 45 minutes away from there, going over to Diesel Pros and seeing what kind of stuff they have in the shop. We're going to be doing probably a toolbox tour and showing some differences between what you guys would see here in an automotive mechanic shop with a dealership and a lifestyle and a performance and diesel upfit shop. So for all the guys who have been asking me a whole bunch of questions lately on, hey, I'm wanting to get into the automotive field. I don't know whether I want to get into the car stuff or whether to get into the diesel truck kind of stuff. You know, this is going to be able to fill out some of those answers for you. What kind of tools you guys are going to want, what kind of shop you're going to be working in, what kind of work you're going to be doing. We're going to do a comparison video between the automotive stuff here at the shop and the shop over at Diesel Pro. So you guys can see a comparison between the two. It's gonna be a really fun weekend and I'm gonna probably have a week's worth of footage to be able to edit after we get back. So that one's gonna be a really cool one. Uh, plus I've got some really neat things planned out for tool videos next week also. We're gonna be doing some product testing between wrenches. I really like, if you guys haven't checked out Den of Tools, he does some really good product videos and everything and did a lot of cool testing on wrenches this last week. Well, I kind of want to progress on the testing that he did and do a little bit more in, those, in that way. So we're going to be doing some new product testing on some wrenches of the big three manufacturers. Uh, see what you guys like in the way of wrenches because any more of these wrenches that you're buying from Snap-on Mac and Macco are costing anywhere upwards of $500. So we're going to be testing Matt, Matco, Snap-on, SP Tools, Craftsman, maybe a couple of other ones, and seeing um, some different outputs and readings and stuff that we have from those wrenches. So I just thought it's going to be a cool video. So keep in mind for that one. One thing else you ought to mention is who we're sponsored or who we're sponsored with right now uh, with the podcast. Oh, that's right. If you guys didn't know or haven't checked out very many podcasts lately. Toolheads Crate has uh, teamed up with a podcast called Grease the Wheels. They're the Grease the Wheels Nation. They have this awesome podcast with Uncle Jimmy. He's a hilarious guy. They put out a podcast every Wednesday, usually Wednesday night and a Thursday. They'll put it out, and it's like a half an hour long podcast that they're going to be uh, putting out. They're a sponsor of Toolheads Crate. So really awesome thing. If you're into podcasts, go and check out Grease the Wheels. You you won't be disappointed in getting that. So make sure that one is, you guys are checking that one out. Okay, we're gonna well, flip the camera around so you guys can that's see. That's about all I've got there for was this people, one. There was a couple of people asking if there would be a point to ask questions during this live stream. So. Oh, you can ask some questions. And JRC came in and said, I don't wanna get in trouble at work, but I wanna say hi. Freaking JRC. <laughs> all right, if you guys do have any questions, I guess Bye, go guys. ahead and ask away. Captain Ron, my cameraman is leaving me, so. I guess it's just gonna be me here in the shop for the next couple of minutes, at least until 6 a.m. or 6 p.m., which is in 15 minutes when my uh, uh, video premieres and I kinda need to be on for my own premiere video. So any questions, go ahead and put those in now. <clears throat> I'm gonna set you guys up on my little camera stand. See where my chair went. Why'd the chicken cross the road? Because he was only left footed. So that'd make him hop along. What do you put in your beard to make it so shiny and nice? Uh, use um, Suavecito and um, a couple other random beard products. Who, 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 let the dogs out? <laughs> great questions, great questions. Hold on. Gotta get the stool here. Getting serious about this. My transmission keeps shifting hard and slipping, but I've heard everyone say different things. What transmission? What vehicle? How do you grow a beard mustache? First off, Tony, you don't chop it off. I mean, that would be first one right there. Bolton in the UK. 
UK subscribers. What's up, buddy? I'm gonna fix this here. Hold on. I'm gonna fix my little stand. I got this. I'm, I'm a professional, trust me. Can I enter any of the... Cheaper? Yeah, that helps too. <laughs> Should I work at a dealership or an independent shop? So that's a very good question. Um, maybe also revert back to a couple of my videos on working with the dealership. Also, JRC f puts out a lot of videos based on working in his independent style shop. It's going to be how you like to work. The A lot of dealerships, you have to be kind of choosy on that one. Um, I'm not a big fan of big dealership kind of atmospheres. I worked at one for about a year and I'm really glad I got out of that atmosphere. It's a big hassle and you're nothing more than, a, you know, kind of a number in their system. So if you're able to get into a smaller dealership, I work, we work at a dealership where there's literally only four technicians and it's, it's the way to go. I love working at a smaller dealership. Um, a lot more hands-on with everyone and everything. Uh, yep, buy a sherry. That's right. Oh, and Grave Before Shave. That's the other beard product that makes this thing all fantastico-like. Yep, Grave Before Shave. Prefer the cigar blend is actually the... Uh, scent that I use if you really wanted to know that <laughs> so if you guys didn't know or you just tuned in uh, Mr. Jose Martinez is the one who won this badass little mini impact gun so he needs to get a hold of me on email with his Instagram ID if he doesn't I'm going to to um, actually draw a new name on Monday so Again, big shout out to SP Tools USA for hooking me up with that giveaway for all of you guys to enjoy. We're gonna be doing more of them here coming up. You work for a huge dealer and they take good care of you. That's really good, man, because you know I just have not had that kind of experience in working with large dealers. Why don't you have a Rust Belt sticker? Well. I haven't been really focusing in very much on my Rust Belt stickers. I've got them for sale over on my Facebook uh, page, but I haven't really been pushing those. I'm not, I'm not one for pushing a lot of my personal merchandise kind of thing. Uh, Toolheads Crate is another thing because you know it helps out a lot of the tool community. Gets a lot of. I guess outward reach towards the companies that we work with so you guys get let known about some of these companies before they even you know come to market in some stances kind of like motive x last month motive x is a newer company into the tool market and they're killing it on what they do at the prices that they can get their tools for they really do an awesome job so yeah this month we're working with sp tools so sp tools has sponsored the golden wrench uh crate for this month as well you're going to be winning that 20 through 32 millimeter ratcheting wrench uh set so it's about a 380 400 value from sp tools usa if you guys haven't checked them out go over and check out their website sptools-usa.com they are going to have a new updated website out probably out here in the next couple of weeks Right now, their their website is up and running, but it's got a limited quantity to what they have available online. Their actual selection of tools and everything in their lines is going to be much larger coming up here within the next uh, next month or so. You're gonna see be seeing a whole lot more tools. I'm gonna be doing more reviews uh, from some of the stuff that I picked up from them. So make sure you stay tuned in for that one. Captain Ron a toolbox giveaway. <laughs> no, we're not giving away a toolbox. I'm not quite that big yet. Now, once we get up to like 50K, 60,000 subscribers, dude, you might be thinking that. It might be something that we could look into. But uh, the giveaway for my 20K is going to be a lot bigger. It's going to be a pretty good one. It's going to be awesome. We're going to see where, where I'm at right now. 
go back to my home page and have a look at this one. Uh oh, severe thunderstorm warning. Ugh. Right now we are at 19,684 subscribers. We're getting close guys. Dude, we've, we've been going up about 100 subscribers a day. So at that rate, we're only like three days or so off. Maybe the end of this next weekend from hitting 20K. Dude, that's a big number. It's a really big number. I am I feel absolutely amazing to be able to see that one. No, it's not. It's going to be bigger than that. Bigger than a half-inch air gun. Much, much cooler. Yeah, when you get to 10K, you're going to give away Rust Belt's toolbox. Well, you know, not to hope ill on you, but hopefully you never get there because ain't nobody going to be stealing my toolbox. They'd be prying it from some cold, dead fingers is what you'd have to be doing because this is my baby forever. Not going anywhere. So, yeah, when we do get to the 20K, it's, it's going to be a really awesome time. Uh, we're going to be doing a giveaway, and I'm going to be running that giveaway for a little bit longer than I did this last one for the SP Mini Impact because I know a lot of guys, they, they like to watch my channel, but they're busy. Dude, you're so busy, and you're not able to get on, you know, week in, week out. You don't see my weekly updates very much, but I really want, like, especially all my original followers to be able to get in on this one. Uh, I am going to say this that a lot of my earlier followers and everything and people who have uh, joined with me earlier on are going to have better of a chance at winning the giveaway. I am not downplaying anyone, any one of my subscribers for coming in earlier or later, but I want to say thank you and appreciate Rocky Star. Yeah, I did. I really want to say I appreciate all of my subscribers, especially the guys who came in early when I was at like 800 a thousand subscribers and I got cheered on from that point it it really made a big difference to see that you know my subscriber base cares about what I do they enjoy watching the content that I put out and they I get messages and emails from guys all the time saying thank you for putting this video out it helped me to choose you know the shop that I went to or choose the dealership or choose the toolbox that I ended up you know picking out and I absolutely love it you know, it's awesome to get those messages all the time, you know, and, and guys are like, oh, I don't want to be bothering you or anything, but dude, I'll make time. I, I always like to make time for being able to talk to the fans and talk to the subscribers that I do have. Yeah. If you're already announced, I have already announced the winner hamster and it was Jose Martinez. This video will stay up, so you'll be able to, to see on there. The The winner was Jose Martinez won the Half Inch Mini Impact. It was not based off the people that are in here. It was based off of people who put Enter Me into the comments of the SB Tools video. I mean, you're still, you still have the, the, the availability to get in, but I'm just gonna say that the odds will be better for the ones who followed earlier. Yep, life ain't fair, but that's the whole point. I'm the one doing this subscription and the one doing this giveaway, and I want to say thank you to the guys, especially the ones who um, came on early, guys, girls, whatever, and the people who came on to support me, and that's what I want to be able to give some stuff away to. So for the people who came in earlier, you're going to be you know, a little bit more rewarded on that one, but even if you end up joining the channel tomorrow, you still are going to have the availability to get in on the next giveaway, which if, depends on when we hit 20,000. So make sure you share some of the videos and be able to get the word out for the Rust Belt Mechanic. Once I get to 20K, we're going to give away a very, very awesome item that only one winner will win. We're not giving away two or three, just one. One single one, just like today, SP Tools hooked us up. So big thank you again to them. I think we're going to be cutting this one off because I have my newest video premiering here in about five minutes. So I'm going to stay here on my computer here at work and be able to chit and chat with you. Uh, if you want to hop on over to that link 
and go over to that video. Any details on it? Are you going about doing this? You're going to have to wait and see. Yep, you're going to have to wait and see. I, I've got my own way to be able to do this one. And, you know, I'm going to probably get a lot of people complain about how I do this next giveaway. But you know what? It's my channel. It's my giveaway. I want to say thank you to the people who I want to say thank you to. Um, it's not going to be fair 100% to everybody. But you know what? I do what I want. And nobody tells me what to do on this channel. So this if you guys don't like it then you know you might not have picked the right channel but I, I i appreciate everybody that has come on to the rust belt mechanic nation here and joined in with this channel we're going to be coming up with a whole lot more content here coming up i've got better greater ideas dude i seriously have probably a list of 30 plus videos that i either want to make need to make or have the stuff to already make i just i just need to find the time <laughs> i we're we're redoing the house right now so we've had the whole first floor ripped up uh we're trying to do tool heads crate stuff at the same time uh tool heads crate stuff if you don't subscribe to that that one goes out on the 15th every month so we've got crates to get ready this next week on top of that captain ron and myself are going to be out of the state we're going to be in michigan this weekend so we won't have the weekend to get caught up on this time but it's going to be a fun time it's going to be well worth it i'm going to have a lot of content and a lot of videos for this next week um the winner was jose martinez we did the drawing uh, i will keep this video live at, or not live but it will be posted up so the winners can see it jose martinez ended up winning the half inch mini impact gun so he needs to email me with his name and tag and Instagram tag. If he does not get a hold of me by Monday, Monday I will do another drawing and we will get another new winner because we're gonna get a, a winner. Somebody's gonna win it, it's not going unclaimed. You're gonna get a brand new one. A Martinez or Hose B Martinez. <laughs> He said he's a funny guy, funny, funny guy. <laughs> well, it's really cool to have you guys to hang out with. Uh, let's go and hop on over to the new video because it's gonna be premiering here in two minutes. So I'm gonna get off the camera, off the screen here so this one can post. So that way anybody who's seeing it later will be able to get on and everything. But the new video is premiering here in two minutes. It's the right smell mechanic video. Have you seen it? So. It's going to be something cool with Matt Co organization in my Epic Toolbox. Something new, fancy, great. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. So signing off, guys. I appreciate being able to talk to you. And, of course, as always, you guys stay awesome.